Now Gildan has definitely come a long way from the scratchy t-shirts we used to know and love. What is up team and welcome back to Guy Maverick. I'm Eric, founder of GuyMaverick.com and the Guy Maverick YouTube channel. Today we're heading back to the perfect heavyweight t-shirt series where I take heavyweight t-shirts from popular brands, review them, and compare them across each episode. Today, we're taking a look at the Gildan Hammer tee. Can't wait to show you guys this t-shirt, which meant to be the competitor to the Hanes Beefy tee. So without further ado, let's get to it. with the Gildan Hammer Tee. Now this t-shirt is a six ounce, 100% cotton crew neck t-shirt. I got it in white and it's sold and manufactured by the Gildan Corporation. Let me show you guys. Here's the collar. Here's the shoulder seams. It's, so here's the curvature of my shoulder. The seam starts about right there. You'll see the sleeves shorter sleeves than the beefy tee and you have the chest it's a little bit snugger of a chest and the body so here it is first impression of this t-shirt it feels soft it's a uh, it definitely doesn't have that as soft feeling as the Hanes beefy tee but it still is a far cry from the scratchy uncomfortable t-shirts from the 90s. I picked up the Gillen Hammer tee on a wholesale t-shirt website with a plethora of probably about seven or eight different t-shirts as well. But you can find the Gillen Hammer t-shirt on Gillen's website, of course. Take a look at Amazon.com, t-shirt wholesale or blank apparel websites. Tons of places you can find this t-shirt if you want to pick one up for yourself and try it out. Now this t-shirt is a great shirt. I do want to let you guys know something though. I only got one size in this bad boy the medium, and it did shrink. Now, no, it didn't shrink from like a large to a small or anything like that. I would say it shrank from like a medium to like a small medium. So it's not a full size, it's like a half of an increment down, uh, but it did make this thing uh, quite a bit snugger than it was before and then I would like. This would definitely work as an undershirt if you wanted something a little bit snugger. As an overshirt or as a shirt by itself, I might either recommend going with a different brand or sizing up, but it's a good t-shirt. Now I'll be honest with you guys, I had no idea that Gildan Hammer Tee was an actual t-shirt until I started doing my research for this series. People usually associate Gildan with the thin, scratchy, uncomfortable feeling t-shirts of the 90s and early 2000s. So they did get kind of a bad rap. When I discovered this t-shirt, I did the research and I bought it. I put it on and I was pleasantly surprised at the feeling of this t-shirt. Definitely isn't like those t-shirts they used to sell. They still sell those t-shirts. I bought one from Hobby Lobby and it feels just as scratchy and just as thin as I remember. This t-shirt though is definitely not that. As an undershirt, it's great. If I wish I would have got a size up in this t-shirt like I did with the Hanes. I didn't think of it, uh, but if I did, I think I would have loved to see how the difference in sizes fit like I did with the Hanes. Now, I'm sure you guys are wondering which one stacks better in my opinion, the Hanes or the Gildan. Now they're both around six ounces, they're both 100% cotton, and they're both manufactured by pretty large, long-lasting brands, Hanes and Gildan. This was actually washed in the same wash cycle as the Hanes was, so they got the same treatment in terms of washing and drying. Now because of that, I would have to give the edge to Hanes. The Hanes does feel weightier. And it does feel softer. For reference, I'm 5'9", about 165 pounds, and I consider myself a lean build. I'm not overly skinny, but I'm not extremely muscular, as you can see. Now, I'm not saying you shouldn't try this Gildan Hammer t-shirt. I believe you should. I'm glad I did. I would definitely gonna use this thing as an undershirt. I'm definitely gonna use this thing kind of as like a second layer with another t-shirt up top. Now, Gildan has definitely come a long way from the scratchy t-shirts we used to know and love. 
and I think it's restored my faith in the Gildan brand. Now, one of the gripes I have on this t-shirt is the sleeves. Now, you'll notice the sleeves are a big gripe on most of the t-shirts I'll be trying on because they're just so big. There's no reason for them to be so big. Why does the chest and body feel so tight, but the sleeves are so big? Look at this thing. This is one of the reasons I love heavyweight t-shirts. Can you see any bit of skin out of this t-shirt at all? Any bit? No, it's just completely white. And you know what? It hides my imperfections like crazy. You can't see my mole. I'm just kidding. You can't see really anything and it doesn't wrinkle much at all because if it's heavier weight, it makes it awesome. Let me know what other videos you guys want to see in the future and I'll be sure to do the research and add it to my roster of videos to make. Just so you know, this video and the previous video on the Haynes BVT are non-sponsored videos. I bought these with my own money and decided to give my own honest review on the t-shirts because I noticed reviews on these kinds of things were lacking on YouTube. Thanks for watching my review of the Gildan Hammer Tee in this Perfect Heavyweight t-shirt series. Now keep your eyes peeled because new videos in this series come out every single Sunday. Last week we took a look at the Haynes Beefy Tee, this week we took a look at the Gildan Hammer Tee, and next week we're taking a look at an Amazon.com exclusive, the Funny World Heavyweight 7.8 ounce t-shirt. Yes, I did say a brand is named Funny World. We're going to take a look. I would like to let you guys know that the Funny World branded t-shirt has one of the softest feeling exteriors of a t-shirt I have ever felt. It's almost velvet-like in its feeling. So I'm excited to show you guys that, the fit, feel, and my first impressions, my opinions. Check back. Don't forget, check out GuyMaverick.com for more information. Follow me on Instagram at ThatGuyMaverick. I'll see you guys next week. And don't forget, dream as if you'll live forever. Live as if you'll die today. Thanks. See you next time.